I still got joy in chaos. I've got peace that makes no sense. I wouldn't be going under. I'm not moved by what I see. I put my faith in Jesus. He'll never let me down. He won't. He won't fail. He won't fail. He won't. Hello, guys. I thought I could do a real, a proper sit down video. And I don't want to be, I don't want to cry. You see, sometimes when things happen, <coughs> you'll be wondering what, why is everything like this? What's really going on? You'll not understand what God is about to do. So I'm here to share a testimony how three bold drivers made my mom have a new car. Three. I'm going to share this so that you will know that when God, you know, allows certain things to happen in your life, it's for a purpose. I thought I could really sit down and do a video where I could, you know, say things and, you know, move my both hands so that, but I, I don't think I'll have the patience to wait till then. But so I should tell you this, guys. Thank you guys for watching our videos. Please consider subscribing to our channel. I'm so happy. I don't know how to do it. So on Monday, I took my mom to the hospital for her routine checks because, of course, by the grace of God, she'll be going back. She's been with me for over a year and um, three months, I guess. Yeah. And so I, my husband had dropped us in the hospital. Normally, he takes us to the hospital for checks and then he will take us back. Most times, my husband will even wait for us. But if he has something to do, work related, he will go. So that day, he dropped us and then he went for a business meeting. And for some reason, I wasn't feeling well that day, so I felt so weak. And in the hospital, they had given me hot water to take. So after seeing my doctor, he spoke with me, and I was fine. As in, I was getting a, a lot better. I waited. I, I ordered for both. Both. They did not call me. And then the guy will arrive. I don't know who he was. I don't know where he, Of course, you know, it's the hospital, and then there are other vehicles. Okay, at least you call me and tell me what position you are at, right? This guy didn't do that. And then I canceled. The second guy, I he did the same thing. He was chatting with me. I hate that thing that both will chat with me. I don't like public transport. When I say this, if you have been watching my videos, you say I don't like anything public transportation. Not out of pride, but sometimes for security reasons, because I've had my own fair share of both drivers on um, shenanigans, and I didn't want any of those things to happen to me. So that was it. Then the third one had, you know, booked this guy, and the guy was not coming and then he was sending me chats so i had to res respond to the chat like excuse me i am your customer you call me you don't chat with me like we are not friends why should you chat with me so i was like why didn't you call me the guy was like hey i'm sorry that you didn't have a recharge card i'm like i don't understand you are doing a business and you don't have a recharge card to call me so i'm supposed to be the one calling you and i say no that is at the vulcanizer i said oh my god okay you had at, at the vulcanizer you'd have called me that i should book another boat now why are you doing this the next thing I, I, I just said in the hospital that I do I don't that is why I don't even like public transportation. So one of the front desk person was like she calm down that she doesn't know why both people are behaving like this. In fact, I just called her now to break this news to her. That was it too. And then we came out and I told my mom that she should come out of the hospital uh, building and just sit under the shade, like inside the hospital environment, but so that if I take a regular taxi, she can, you know, go. Because my kids were really feeling fine. And I didn't want to keep them so long, being that I didn't have a, a, a living maid. So, my, I kept my mom there. So, as I was walking to, a, I saw one red jeep. But, you know, of course, <laughs> that's not the car I was looking for. And then the person, I saw the person wind I was like, all oh, these men again, they started. So, I didn't even look that side. So, somebody went down, and it was a fair lady. She now smiled. My aunt's friend. She said, Kuti, I saw she, that she was just saying, who is this um, fine, tall, young lady on a jumpsuit, that she was just admiring my jumpsuit, and then the way I was walking. I said, it's, it's me, we were just laughing, I was like, ah, so I'm still fine. Like, she said, Kuti, you don't even look one bit married, so we are just laughing. So she was like, what are you doing? I said, I came with mommy, we came for checkup. So, so why are you going to? I said, I want to get a taxi. The way she looked at me was strange because she would not naturally see me with my mom in a taxi. So she kept quiet. And then I brought in the taxi. We took mommy out. And she saw mommy. She entered the other taxi, saw mommy. 
So she now was asking mommy how mama was feeling. Mommy said she's fine, that she'll soon be leaving Abuja. Ah. She now said, okay, no problem. We didn't know what was in her mind. You see, when this year, the people gossip good gossip oh, that will bring you testimony. So my she now called my aunt and said, I saw your sister by the roadside. Hey, we weren't by the roadside, but that's how she put it, that she saw us by the roadside. So the, this my aunt has always promised to buy my mommy car for like some years now. She keeps saying, mommy, I'll come with your car. I'm coming big. But because of some certain things that were, you know, happening, she was not frequent in the country. She was not really around shy. She wasn't in the country, so she wasn't around. So when they told her, I think she became mad that how can they, the sister be seen by the roadside? Hmm. That's how yesterday being Friday. Of course, this thing happened on a Monday, right? So from Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, she was calling different car, you know, shops to ensure that she got the best car for her sister. Hmm. So I'll just say yesterday they called me that they are bringing her cow. Hmm. That was how they brought her car. I'll be showing you for the car. The next videos you'll be seeing is how they brought the car and everything. So mommy had the car. And that is why sometimes when things how can three both people not call me like they had the same mannerism everything it's you know it you get i know that i have phobia for entering boats because of my last ex my, one of my experiences with boats that i was sexually assaulted i don't know if that's the right word to use so guys i just decided to share this with you happy new month everybody thank you for watching our videos please ensure to watch this video to the very end and watch everything that happened and good news will come to you congratulations in advance too because you will share your testimony so i just thought to bring this here to encourage someone that god i say even in the position you are now god can still answer and when you see things happening you miss your flight just know it's the workings of god and it's for a reason thank you guys for watching this video oh yeah continue watching the rest thank you for your love towards us amen. we thank you for your mercies amen. even when we sin against you yet you still bless us amen you don't look at our deeds to amen. bless us amen. we thank you for this beautiful gift amen. that you have given to our mom yeah we thank you for your faithfulness amen. we thank you for for the many things that you have done for us amen. that brings us joy amen <laughs> Very correct, guy. Mm -hmm. Very correct, Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Amen. 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 Hey, Sankara Kina, Penny, I come and see. Now that's the main toy and then the play number. So one's what I can tell you. Brother, calm down. Let me. This is. This is not. No, you will face like this. Let him face like this. You should face us. No, but I'm not going to do another way. Yes, sir. Nandeli. Everything is okay.